Ghost of Song. Oops, it's taking me back down, but it's okay. Level up so much doing flashpoints in Star Wars. Holy crap! I went from level 28 to 31 in a in a single run. Station security online. Lockdown in progress. Oh, Jesus. Get your heels here. I guess that's the class that I'm playing in. Adaptive armor? I mean... Oh, requires level 65. No, I don't want that. <laughs> I'm only level 31, guys. I'm, I'm the small bab. <laughs> Protect me! <laughs> I mean, it scales. Oh, it does not scale me up in this instance. The last time it scaled me up, I am not scaled up this time. This time it's. <laughs> what level are they? 70? Help, help, I'm dying. Help, help. <laughs> no, man, it feels bad. Like the downside of being a new player is hopping into this stuff. You, you just have to get carried until you can assist the team. Oh, did you, did you spook him? Wow, rude. Can't can't talk to Nikki that way. Oh my god. You can get out of a jacket. Oh, nothing over here. Oh shit. Child. This is Batman Prison to El Prisoner. Okay. 
jealous rivals would destroy our great work. But today, the Atmos Hegemony earns its place in the galaxy. <laughs> Does she want to come play Star Wars? No. Oh. Targeting systems locked. I'll never find anyone. No, don't die! I'll heal you. And someone else has done it. Targeting systems locked. What is she going? Oh Jesus! Oh Jesus! Targeting system locked. I don't know. Uh oh, one of them died. Systems locked. What? What the hell is that? I do say random shit all the time, but that one, that one takes it. She wins. Wow, rude. I see how it is. I didn't know you loved me more than you loved her. <laughs> Knew it. I mean, I didn't know it because I, I just said I didn't know. I'll, I'll stop now. What did I get? Ooh. Ooh. Yes. Yes, I do. Yes, you do. I don't understand how they ran past these characters. Help, come back, I am small, Sith. Protect me. Money. <laughs> Mr. That's why Mr. Crab is the only crab around. <laughs> oh, it's probably human spider eggs or something. Yo, what the fuck is that? Made mistakes. I don't know why I ran out there. I don't know this instance. And none of them are telling me what to do. I'm sorry, I'm sorry, I'm sorry, I'm sorry, don't die. Oh, requires level 65. No, pass. There are, there are better players to get that, I don't know.
<laughs> Maybe they thought they were playing Destiny and they turned their brains off. This station is capable of pulverizing continents. Do you think it will fail to a single strike team? Pure arrogance. Holy shit, I'll heal you. I'm trying. I'm trying. I was not prepared to be a healer, but apparently that's what I'm doing now. This conversation got weird. Did I just get new gloves? No, they're the same level. Getting purple gear at level 30, because, you know, that's totally what I need. Is that necessary? Oh, I hit that run. Run, 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 run. Oh, shit, you are done. Holy balls. It looks familiar. Oh shit, oh, bro, this is that mission that we did that one time. A bajillion times! Thank <laughs> you. 
mission to all personnel. Rally to Section Zero. We fight for our homeworld and the Supreme War Master. of the Empire. All that power, yet you still fear us. They're giant. I am a battle lord of the Ampos hegemony. You will fall before me. Your witness is in your blood. <laughs> Achievement complete. Dropped the hammer. Sweet. That one is short. Alright, back to hop into the main storyline. There's enough of a detour doing random flashpoints. station has been destroyed. I have seen the reports. You faced formidable opposition. The Supreme War Master of the Adversar Hegemony has offered his life in reparation for his people's misdeeds. The Adversac will never again pose a threat. They fought well. They could be useful under Imperial control. A reasonable approach. I will consider it. You may also wish to hear that intelligence has decrypted the station's data. We know how the adversary hegemony obtained a Republic superweapon. Not gonna lie. Mistake, Hoji Hatal Al, Alasolak Oraban. 
Folio Samisam, Ugin is it key? Dude, I played that so well, and she just... It was Republic incompetence, not malice, that resulted in the adversary's rise to power. There is a lesson in that. The lesson is that when the next war comes, the Republic doesn't stand a chance. So long as our own strength is true, you may return to your duties. But know that you have done well. You may be called upon again. Where is my goddamn turbo lift? Where is my super suit? I am the greater good. <laughs> Return to the ship always warms my circuits, Master. Reminds me I am still functioning. Go on, bud. Wow. 
Kratos. I've no no jape siglos fraudnos jus jape right a jape. What dark secret shall I share with you? Be gone. You be gone. Tell me what to do. 20 levels higher than you now. Just get off Apex.
Bond. What weird future did you just end up in, Ogre? What the fuck? Sucker. We're about petty burglary. I wonder what your master would think if she knew you were breaking and entering. <laughs> or did she by chance send you on this little errand? This is my own doing. So I thought. Your master and I hardly see eye to eye, but this isn't her style. Too much risk of getting caught, too little reward. That's all the marks of an apprentice. When Darth Thanaton learns of this, you will be punished. That mask is mine, by right of inheritance. Don't be ridiculous. You're a slave. Still are. The only thing you'll inherit is a slave collar. be taking that mask now goodbye lord crucis and thank you for the artifact because it's mine by birthright <laughs> this is not new for void <laughs> there's always a secret room And just when you think you're at the end, you'll have to look deep inside. <laughs> 
and you'll find another secret room. <laughs> Proud of you. So clean. Young one, it was never hidden. Apprentice, I know you are very busy, but I must speak with you. I have just had the most amazing dream, and it concerns you. Can't get me out of your head, can you? In the dream, I could see the power of the Force coursing through you. Armies of Jedi rose in your path and fell before you. It's the artifact. It must be. The artifact will give you this power. What makes you say that? Only certain individuals, it seems, are properly attuned to the ritual the artifacts describe. I believe the remaining artifacts are on Tatooine and Alderaan. You must hurry and find them. The artifacts are the key to fulfilling your destiny.
Yeah. Uh-oh. I think she just heard. All the time. Hey, he heard that time. Oh, he loves me. Oh. No, thank you. Fucking Alderaan first. Been to Tatooine so many times, and that's when I get bored. <laughs> I'm always here. Most marvelous apprentice. It's good to see you've made it safely to Alderaan. It really is a wonderful world. So rich in history. It's a shame you won't have time to visit the libraries. I've never understood your fascination with reading. To each his own, I suppose. Alderaan is a planet in the throes of civil strife. A usurper sits on the throne and all of Alderaan's nobles make war. Your artifact was discovered by the Jedi Order years ago and given to one of Alderaan's noble houses. I don't know which one. Any idea where I should start? House Thule is allied with the Empire. Their young leader, Alana Thule, is eager to help you. Go to House Thule and speak with her. Hopefully with her aid, you can reclaim the missing artifact.
evil are crows. All items are subsidized by the Empire to help your mission. For the Emperor. We've just received some new items you might be interested in. For the Emperor. At your service, sir. the Emperor. <laughs> Not how the song goes. <laughs> Greetings. He's screaming the leg! I bring the good wishes of Moff Sarek, the officer entrusted with annexing this planet. He has been anticipating your arrival. Oh my, it's, it's a Demogorgon. It's a Demogorgon ogre. You'll be fine. Yeah. It is fitting that we speak. A good day, my lord. It will well serve the aims of the Empire to have so accomplished a Sith on this planet. I expect you care little for the niceties of politics here, so I will be brief. The Empire intends to use Alderaan's succession struggle to bring it into the fold, and I'm offering you the opportunity to play a pivotal role. Alderaan would make a fine jewel. The, the sleep crown. is powerful the with the one who has found that. Right after withdrawing from the protection of the Republic. Do it! The planet's in civil war, and for the first time in thousands of years... Do it! ...without the armies of the Republic to bring order. A divided world will fall quickly. Yes. We must make our move now. While the throne stands empty. We have an alliance with one of the noble houses. House Vol. The house was exiled 60 years ago after a failed bid for power and came to us instead. Unfortunately, they have proven too weak to do what's needed. Perhaps we should trust their methods. If Alderaan is to be part of the Empire, they must learn what that means. Jorad, one of the Thal Lords, insists on following Alderaan's rules of civilized warfare. I want you to show him warfare is far from civil. Several of Thal's vassal houses have rebelled since Thal's connection to us became public. This cannot be allowed. Take a slave collar from my man here and drag one of these rebels to our weak-willed Lord Thal. Kill the rest and leave them where they fall. These Alderaan lordlings will beg to serve the Empire. These lords of Alderaan must lose their foolish pride. Those who will not bow must break.
Who, who's getting murdered in your house? Murdering someone? Huh. Shame. And some mints. Nematodes. <laughs> you just have to help them calm down. They just, you know, took a little bit too much, too many drugs. They still think they're at the club. You gotta hit it with the super combo. You can do it! Can't let up! Greed. Mmm. Worth.
job. Super exploder of doom from downtown. <laughs> from downtown. What is who? Uh, Krymar. Is that Krymar Noven? That's a free nobleman of Alderaan. Unhand him. Who are you? W what, what's this about? <gasps> Join the Empire. You should take more care to recognize those in power. Uh, my lord. All of Alderaan will be thrown into chains because of you. Silent slave. The sooner you see reason, the easier it'll be. I, I've said before that being too harsh might stir greater rebellion. Though, of course, that's that's up to you. I believe that is up to me. Sir. This spineless toad will make a poor lord of Alderaan. Yes. It will take work to shape him. I hope you will undertake this for me. I would like to make you the voice of the Empire in House Thor. Aid Jorad and his men in crushing resistance to our rule. Obey him as if it were me. And with the same penalty for defiance. Tell him what you need, and he will ensure Thull's hold on Alderaan. Yes, sir. Sir. Penalty for defiance. I like the sound of that. I suppose the Moth expects us to take on House Organa. They're one of our oldest noble houses and loyal to the Republic. Until recently, they've been without an army, but they've got supporters all over the planet, uh, including here. You'll never find them. They've got top-of-the-line cloaking better than anything the Empire makes. No probes will get through, no spy sats, nothing. You're weak and a fool. House Organa denied raising an army, claiming it's just patriots defending their lands. But their attacks are too organized. We'll never find every group. We need to get inside their planet-wide communications. And that means finding a base with a physical link to slice into. They will learn the folly of resisting the Empire. Alderaan is a free world. We will never submit. Silence! If you stand with the Organas, you betray a thousand years of loyalty. The Organa guerrillas have a base hidden in some cave or other natural camouflage. There should be a master comlink there, guarded by their best soldiers. If you insert this computer spike, it'll give us a back door into all their communications. Once we can hear them, there's nowhere on this world they'll be safe. House Organa will not make another move without us knowing. My lady, this must be the Sith we've been expecting. I can feel his power. Welcome, Sith. I'm sorry for the chaos. Alderaan is on the brink of civil war, but House Thule owes the Empire so much. 
What did the Empire do for you? Before I was born, House Thule was accused of conspiring to steal the throne. We were disgraced and driven off Alderaan. The Empire gave us a home in exile and helped restore us to our rightful place on Alderaan. But our history can hardly be of interest to you. Darth Zash mentioned you're after a certain artifact. Am I correct? You've heard correctly. Excellent. Then I should be able to help you quite a bit. Allow me to introduce Ertl Morin. He's my personal Sith guard. He did some preliminary investigation after Darth Zash called. It is an honor. I've heard many things about Lord Zash's apprentice. I began my research on a hunch house Organa close to ties with the Jedi. We captured and chatted with a Chamberlain of House Organa. He confirmed that Organa holds the artifact and that it is kept in their private vault in the Elysium. What's the Elysium? The Elysium is an ancient and majestic ruin on Alderaan, now reduced to a battlefield. Unfortunately, the Elysium is sealed tight, and the key is held by Noma Organa, a powerful, revered, and insufferable Jedi Master. You are the only Sith on Alderaan who even stands a chance of defeating Noma. We must bring him here. Noma Organa has a reputation for strength and power, but above all, for his principles. He is, by all accounts, was an awesome a show. Jedi, but everyone has weaknesses. Isn't that right? I think about it about maybe once a week. Yeah. Everyone has weaknesses. Good times. I mean, granted, the, it evolved. I suggest it's pretty much what the library of House uh, Alder. Robot Chicken is They are now. devoted keepers of Alderaan's history. Personal connections, I think, would be most useful. Siblings, he was particularly close to, childhood friends. But be careful. House Alde is a close ally of Organa. They're likely to attack anyone from Thule on sight. It's a pleasure to meet you, Sith. <laughs> the dark side swells within yes. you. The one where Ogre wins. <laughs> Sounds like you gotta grind it out, finish it tonight, start a new game. Mounts are not allowed in here. You'll be dismounted soon. Bitch, how do you know? You're not Professor Oak. God, what was the... the new truth that Ashi came up with yesterday.
pitiful robots. What should I put on? What do you got? Impressive work. You can see we now have access to the Organa systems. They're all talking about the, uh, the ruthlessness and brutality of the recent attack. They, uh, they do train you Imperials well, don't they? On Korriban, we held little parties each time a fellow student died. I, I see. And, um, anyway, now that we can monitor the Organa's communications, it should be possible to... Lord Thul! The base is under attack. Send aid quickly. Order outpost two under attack. I repeat, under attack. Perimeter defense is breached. We're under attack by assault droids. Repeat, a coordinated attack by probe and assault droids. Blood of the Queen. Sounds like you need a little Imperial support right now. Yes. Show those backbiters that the Empire stands behind House Thule. The data says all three border posts are under attack. Looks like a coordinated effort. Hunter killers and probes. All I've got out there is a skeleton crew. You're the only one no, to reach them in time. That's a zero Please. out of Save five. My bases and bring me the memory cores from any probes you destroy. I want to know who's behind this. Good luck. I'll bring you the heads of those droids and their master. Thank you. Now hurry!
Ashley, you gotta scrape in your leg! Garbage. Cause I'm so over geared because of the fucking flash points. Metal gear! Rival schools. Oh. <laughs> Principals just never retire. They they left school and they're just like, I gotta teach the way of the fist. It's totally possible. I've watched Beelzebub. I know how it goes. That bird is gross. Why? New 
discovery past the lens pond. Um. They're gonna fight for no reason. I stubbed my toe! I have to go speak with the Lord. It's like, um... those droids what's going on here with this giant skeleton and those glowy lights and all these bugs but I don't like it oh I, I did I, I executed all of them showed them the power of my force lightning
house. Oh, I realized my mic was muted. The greatness of your light outshines everyone else's, especially, that's why. I cannot thank you enough for your quick work. I don't know what the Organas were after, but that attack was long in the planning. I really am the best. Sarek honored me by thinking I was worthy of the attention of a Sith. Who's the source of these? What were they looking for? And quickly! The programming signatures point to Lord Cedric Kilesa. Lord Kilesa is my vassal. He swore loyalty to me personally when we returned from exile. I find the best oath of loyalty as a man's firstborn son in shackles. The parameters indicate the probes were to join an assault team in a... My lord, this program indicates an assault team massing in a tunnel between here and the Kalisa Estates. I don't find any such tunnel on the blueprint. The siege tunnel! Blood of a queen! They're, they're coming through the siege tunnel! Those attacks were meant to draw your guards away from the palace. The wretched traitor! That tunnel connects his lands directly to our estates! No one's used it in centuries, but it, it, the tunnel opens right under this room. What are we going to do? I will hold back this army myself if I have to. You have proven a better friend than I expected. Mop Sarek gave us cartons of thermite explosives. They take time to set up, but they, they pack a punch. If you take them into the siege tunnel, you can collapse it on Cedric and his army. Seal the access so they can't threaten us again. You should have sealed it off the minute you went to war. You have taught me the importance of taking action. There's an entrance to the tunnel nearby. The storeroom is in the same area. I'll recall my troops to defend the surface, but there's no doubt the real battle will be below. Thank you.
Oh my god. So, you're the Imperial puppet who taught Jorad Thule to bite instead of bark. Does he lick your hand? Fetch your slippers? Real Alderanians will never bow to the likes of you. No one world can stand up to the might of the Empire. I would sooner see Alderaan blasted into space debris than given over to the Empire. You don't even have the guts to fight this yourself instead of hiding behind a cart and a thermite. If you had a shred of decency, you'd settle this by an honorable duel. You against me. This tunnel's coming down. 
believe that our ruins are more alive than your empire. Retreat! I dropped an entire tunnel on a bunch of rebels while I was still inside. Awesome. I'm the greatest. The Kalejas just surrendered. My men are returning from the outpost to take them into custody. When they saw the tunnel explode around their lord, every man among them laid down their arms. I will tell Moff Selleck of your heroism immediately. Take ten heads for every one traitor, and they will not rebel again. The Thals need not fear any further rebellion in their ranks. It would be a waste to keep one of our few Sith here any longer. General Stunnel Thal is coordinating our efforts near House Ald. Speak to him if you'd like to take a further role in this conquest. That's all that I You've okay. saved my house's dream of ruling our world, and taught me much about what that will mean. I will not forget. You know he is. Both. A little bit of both. is not a long time. What? You mean Ogre's gonna about to put you in a backpack? Inside of another backpack? <laughs> that doesn't even sound like a backpack anymore. That sounds like holding hands. <laughs> Like, is that one mine? I don't know. I'm shooting him right now. Bitch, I'm shooting him. <laughs> Vehicle pads are currently open for business. What the fuck? I thought I was about to hop into a taxi. I hopped onto a giant fucking manta ray flying through the air. Oh, all right. <laughs> all right, Star Wars. told you wanted to see me. Yes, Moff Sarek said you'd be here. We've had an inspection team lost to the Killix for days now. Advisors from Droman Kars. They were inspecting one of our mining sites for lanthanide deposits. But in the middle of their inspection, the entire place was overrun by Killix. We've had no communication for days. Who's that? Some other noble house? Killix are the native aliens here. Giant bugs with just enough brains to hold a blaster. Moff Sarek wants this team back. Apparently, some of them hold serious rank off-world, but the rest of House Thule is balking. 
Attacking these Killicks would take half our army, but apparently I'm too close to the problem to strategically assess its value. Armies do more trying something that will leave half of them dead. If you can do what they cannot, I will owe you a debt I can never repay. It's not only the inspection team. My daughter is in there too. I don't know if she's alive or dead. If you can find her, find our advisors, free them if they're prisoners. I promise you a reward that will leave me bankrupt. I will not let these aliens kill your daughter or the advisors. Thank you. For myself, even more than for my house. everything to me, Master. I will not disappoint you. Thank you. 
me. Uh, isn't it like five grand or more? It isn't, isn't there like? Oh, uh, so tw twenty grand? Cause Apple's dumb and hates everyone. <laughs> you know there's somebody out there who has that and not just one person like multiple people you know that someone has that. I think, uh, oof. Look at Amor giving you all the compliments, Ogre. Look at Amor giving you all those compliments in chat.
have removed those who are not of the nest. Had they stayed, they would have learned the peace of the joining. We will not deny you your prize. But leave now. There has been a song of swarming. We have claimed these mines for the nest. What exactly are you? Once we were called Daria Thule. Now we are known as New Child of the Ukanuku Nest. We have tasted the gel and scented the egg chamber. We have joined. I'm here to save you. You are mistaken. We are not here against our will. We have joined the kind. There is peace in the nest. A love that comes of sharing one mind. It is a gift beyond measure. We will never return. How can you live like this? How do you live in a world where everyone is a stranger? Where a smile may conceal a knife in the back? Stanothul is not my family. He and his kind have brought war to Alderaan in the name of their own power. Here we are safe. Here we are at peace. Here we will stay. Come with me, or die along with every Killick here. That's your only option. No, we will never. We are hearing the voice of the nest. We have decided it is not worth many losses to save one. The nest has spoken. We will return.
John. <laughs> oh my god I thank you all for gathering here. Friends, family, everyone. As you know, this is the day that Rahana and I were to announce our intentions to be married. No. Well, what are you saying? I'm sorry, Rahana. But I've had... I mean, there's been... There's been a change. You coward! I have a responsibility to the Jedi Order. I, I have decided to continue with my training in the Force. Off-world. It's your family, isn't it? They talked you out of this. Damn, Organas think you're too good for us, for my daughter. You'd better be sorry. You will be sorry. Thank you. My medics are treating the inspection team for- I wish I could say the same. It is clear those monsters have drugged. I've heard of this. Something in the pheromones that- She may still recover. I only wish I could- General Fool, excuse me. I'm Agent Craig. 
Are the mines so... The mines are nothing. The push was orchestrated by the Orgos. The distractor... You Alderanians are entirely too cheer. I've heard that term. It's come up a few times in the chatter we're getting from our back door into the Organa networks. It's a Baradium detonator. A massive explosive. They plan to strike at the heart of Full Lands. The detonator's being transported by Boris Ulgo's elite soldiers. Former... Murder and mayhem await. Just before the Killix arrived, we acquired a day. If you read, it won't be the full force of the.
Thank you. You are again Thule's savior, saving our lands from devastation and death. The abilities of the Sith are truly beyond the capacity of the rest of us to understand. Are we finished? Yes, I will not keep you from your business. The Ulgos have retreated to mourn their casualties. Perhaps I should do the same. My superiors have been asking about you. There is some intrigue happening with House Wrist. Trouble for our allies. If you're interested, look for Dathis Elgin. Moff Sarak has already commended you to him. select an available travel route. Have a safe and pleasant stay. Don't you do that in every game? Won't find a better bargain. Come back any time.
keep me apprised of the situation, Ertl. We may need to take action. Ah, Sith. Sorry to keep you waiting. I hope your search in House Alde was fruitful. I've been anxiously dreaming up scandals we could catch the spotless Nomar Organa in. Not really a scandal, but he was engaged once. Engaged? Interesting. Jedi aren't usually the marrying kind. Let me see. Engagement announcement Nomar and Rihanna. My goodness, this is juicy. It must have been somewhere between 20, 30 years ago. Long before I was born, but I remember hearing my nurses talking about it. The sister to the Lord of House Wrist was engaged to a prominent noble against the wishes of both their families. The coward broke it off. You think this Rohana is Lord Rist's sister? It's a perfect fit. Rist is a house of highly trained assassins, and Lady Rist is no exception. But she is perhaps most noted for her stubborn refusal to marry, and for the humiliations she pours on those who ask. Looks like Lady Rist and I need to chat. Yes, I'd say so too. And if she is still in love with Nomar, then you may be able to convince her to lure Nomar to Alderaan. My words will be sweet as honey. But be wary. To reach Rohan Arist, you'll have to contend with the deadliest assassins on Alderaan. Good luck, Sith. I hope your search is going well, my lord. pads are currently open for business. Pop, 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 pop. Yeah, yes, let the anger flow through you. What's a gatekeeper? Ooh.
Good job, Ogre. GG. <laughs> Chicken tendies and your chalky milky. Except I would substitute chalky milky for strawberry milky. This Elgin, Imperial Advisor to House Thule. Am I glad to see you? House Thule faces a crisis that threatens to undermine their entire position on Alderaan. And the Empires as well. You'll have to tell me what this crisis is before I agree to anything. House Wrist. Alderaan's House of Assassins is currently aligned with the usurper House Ulgo. But there was a time when Riss did all manner of secret jobs for whomever paid. Now the dirty details of those jobs are threatening to get out. You need me to teach this House Rist a lesson? Rist has held to their honor. They are not responsible for the current predicament. A former Rist assassin, kicked out for revealing the identity of one of his employers, is blackmailing Thule. He says he'll reveal every assassination, every kidnapping, every conniving thing Thule has done unless we pay him. Just tell me where he is and I'll kill him. I'd rather not have him killed if possible. It raises too many questions. We've arranged a meeting to deliver payment. But he's recruited some of Rist's best assassins to his side. I don't trust him. That's why I need you. Someone strong enough to withstand whatever trap he intends to spring. So what exactly do I do? This man wants to establish his own house of assassins. And he has demanded land and a title as payment for his silence. Take this case and meet him at the assigned meeting place. If he takes the bribe, fine. If not, kill him. You want the world to know you're gonna let me
I have nothing to say to you right now. Oh, I, I need to see this now. Ogre, show me some cuisine royale. Go make me some burgers. It won't do them any good, but I give them points for trying. Now, if you'd kindly hand over the payment. I'm not giving you a thing until I'm sure there are no tricks. Tricks? We've only just met. You already know me so well. I thought Thule would send some scrawny diplomat I could take hostage, but you, you'll fetch a higher price. You will have to beat me first. I'm looking forward to it. This guy! He has the better of us, and besides, it's not worth it! The evidence is already on its way to House Olgo. He had no intention of giving it to you. Don't expect me to leave without getting what I came for. Sam, you idiot! We could have been counts! You've lost all sense of honor! Lie and stealing? I swore to live by a code! The runner with the evidence is delivering it to Olgo's son, Vesix. Sam, you'd betray your own brother? I'll kill you for that! Damn it, Kai. I'm sorry. Look, the coordinates the runner was headed to are in the console over there. You might be able to catch him if you hurry. I'll take Kai's assassins. I promise, neither you nor Thule will hear from us again. We won't be so merciful a second time. I won't forget it. We owe House Thule a big favor. Good luck recovering that evidence. Ba -ba -ba -ba. I take the fact that you're rummaging around in the assassin's files to mean that the meeting didn't go well. The evidence has already gone to Olgo. You're kidding me. Damn it. Well, spare no detail. If Vesix Olgo gets that evidence, soon every house on Alderaan will know who Thule hired Rist to kill and when. They won't just banish Thule, they'll destroy them. And the Empire's chances on Alderaan will die with them. I can't say I envy your position right now. I'm sorry, but I have to ask for your help once more. Vesex Ulgo commands a squad of the most highly trained commandos on Alderaan. They have even defeated Jedi. But you, you may stand a chance. I have to ask you to recover that evidence, quickly. Trust me, I'll take care of it. <laughs> it's so teabag much. time somewhere. Find the evidence, destroy it, and I promise you double the reward when you return. Yeah, you're gonna push out a room? Definitely not the right way to go.
Tell me you've defeated Vesix. Tell me you managed to destroy the evidence of Thul's misdeeds before Ulgo was able to distribute it. And for the last order of business, let's talk money. Never in my entire life have I been so relieved. Here is a reward from House Thul. You've done a great thing for the Empire. I hope you realize that. Please use all products only as intended. Select an available travel route. Have a safe and pleasant stay.
My lord, please stand by a moment. I have urgent orders to put you into contact with my superior, Darth Victus. Ah, you've arrived, finally. I'm told that you've served Darth Zash well in your time as her apprentice. I am Darth Victus. Our Empire has need of you, Sith, here and now. Depends on what you want me to do. The task at hand involves House Pantia, the weakened former rulers of Alderaan. Though most believe them wiped out, a few stragglers yet survive. These surviving Pantiers are needed to legitimize House Thule's eventual rule. We are creating an understanding with them even now, but the forces of House Ulgo plan to interfere. How can I serve the Empire in this matter, my lord? Ulgo has strike teams massing Thranta for transport. They intend to assault the Pantiers' mountain hideaway and slaughter all surviving members of the House. The eradication of House Pantia would greatly impede our plans for House Thule's ascendance. It cannot be allowed. You will find the Ulgo strike teams and destroy them at once. As you say. When it is done, report back to Lieutenant Muir. We will continue our discussion then. Farewell. Good luck. Blink, 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 blink. Ba -la 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 -la. No, you grab his arm.
probes have confirmed the full elimination of Ulgor's strike teams. I will contact Darth Victus immediately. My lord, Lieutenant Muir, the matter is dealt with. Perfect. The Empire is fortunate to have such a capable servant. This accomplishment will be well rewarded. So, what now? I am currently engaged in negotiations with the Pantia survivors at their mountain hideaway. I will arrange for you to be allowed inside. Be sure to conduct yourself cautiously. The Pantia hideaway is neutral soil. They won't tolerate uncalled for aggression. One obstacle still stands before our plans for House Thule. Boris Olgo, the supposed king of Alderaan himself. Oh my we'll God. speak more when you arrive. Farewell, my lord. Good, you've arrived. Allow me to introduce you to Lord Oren Pantier, nephew of the late Queen Silara Pantier, rightful queen of Alderaan. Your Lordship, this is the hero I spoke to you about. The one who prevented Ulgo's barbarous attack against your noble house. It is an honor to meet you. My family owes you a great debt. You will always be welcome in the home of Pantier. I merely sowed a bit of destruction. My pleasure, really. The elimination of House Orgo's strike teams has forced them to draw men from their castle guard. The heart of their house lies exposed. 
Given your exemplary service in defense of House Pantheia, Lord Oren has deigned to grant you an opportunity to shape the future of Alderaan. Oris Ulgo, head of House Ulgo, has betrayed the noble laws of Alderaan and stolen the throne for himself. It will be your task to remove it from him. Is there going to be plenty of death involved? This is one of the most heavily guarded men on all of Alderaan. You will find no shortage of foes. Please, do everything within your power to capture Boris Ulga alive. The people of Alderaan deserve to see that usurper face justice. They deserve... Begging your pardon, my lord. An urgent matter requires your attention. Very well. Tell me what's happened. Captured alive, you will do no such thing. Even in chains, Boris Ulgo is a threat to House Thule's ascendants. He must be killed at all costs. Boris Ulgo has seen his last sunrise. Excellent. Ah, your lordship returns to us. My apologies. Now, you understand the gravity of the task being given to you, don't you? Boris Ulgo is at the center of a castle stolen from our house, surrounded by an army of loyal troops. Until now, no one has dared challenge his position. The look on his face when I blast him to his knees will be priceless. We waited so long. This will be a momentous day. I must make preparations. I'll arrange for a special detachment of our elite Queen's Guard to move in behind you and collect the usurper once the job is done. Good luck. Do not fail us.